Hi, Kathy here. Welcome to the channel. Today I want to talk about the truth about cooking with cast iron. Let me just start off by saying that this is my truth. It may be different for someone else. Other people have different ideas about cast iron, but I've been using cast iron for a long time now, and I wanna share with you my thoughts about cooking with cast iron. Absolutely, in my opinion, amazing. It browns food to just the perfect brown or crispness. You can use it like it's a grill indoors. So in the winter time, we cook hamburgers, we cook steaks, comes out amazing. A lot of people say you can't cook acidic foods unless you're using a cast iron pan that is coated. This has like an enamel coating on the inside as well. But I use my regular Lodge cast iron pan for cooking everything, including acidic foods. As long as it's not sitting in there for a really long time, it really doesn't matter. It still works just perfectly fine. Another great thing about these pans is when you're done cooking, you can literally turn the burner off and it retains the heat for quite a while. You just simply put a nice lid on top and your food stays warm. So if something in that pan is done before something else, it'll stay warm, but it does continue to hold the heat. So once you turn the burner off, you definitely, if you don't want it to cook anymore, you definitely want to remove it from the burner, but you also have to keep in mind that whatever's in the pan will continue to absorb the heat from the pan because the pan is a metal and it transfers the heat very, very quickly and easily. A lot of people say that cast iron is non-stick, and if you're comparing it to a truly non-stick pan, it's really not. But I cook eggs in it all the time with no problem. But you're not going to slide the eggs like out of the pan like you see on the TV commercials. As far as non-stick goes, yeah, you can easily flip over your eggs. No problem, they cook up wonderful. A lot of the non-stick pans have chemicals and things that people don't wanna use. Cast iron is a great alternative. There's really just nothing in it that can harm you. People complain it might change the taste a little bit, but I've never noticed anything. And I, we cook pretty much every night in our cast iron pans. One of the great things about the cast iron pans is the fact that it can go from the stove top and right into the oven. So it handles really high heats with no problem. It can be used on top of a wood stove as long as you're using the classic cast iron, and that's the cast iron that's not enameled. The classic black cast iron can be used on anything, on any surface, but they're heavy. If you want to pick this pan up, you really need two hands. You got to have some strength. You're not really going to be doing it with one hand with food in it, not when it's really burning hot. And that leads me to the next thing, that they're hot. So you definitely want some silicone handles to be able to pick up and hold the pot with, and even to pick up the lid with. Really, all it takes is one or two burns, and trust me, you'll never make that mistake again. It's not fun, but you do get used to it. Another thing about this when you're cooking, a lot of people say that the heating is uneven. And that is accurate. It is a metal and it absorbs the heat from the burner and it takes a while for that heat to spread through the pan. So one of the things that I do when I'm cooking in the pan is I'll throw it on the burner and I will let it heat up for about five minutes before I even attempt to start cooking in it. It's like preheating an oven. To me, it's not a big deal. I know there's a lot of myths out there that say you can't use a metal utensil in the cast iron. I prefer to use wood, but I have used metal, and I've never had a problem at all with any of the cast iron chipping off. If anything is gonna chip off, it's the um, oil, there's a word for it, and I'm not sure what it is, but it creates like a, a, a coating on the inside of the pan, and that could possibly come off, I guess. Never seen it happen, and that is probably due to proper, properly maintaining the pans. Proper maintenance is really key here. Honestly, these are so much easier to wash and clean than my stainless steel pots and pans. And I love my stainless steel pots and pans. 
but these clean up so much easier. If there's a little bit stuck to the bottom, I simply just use a scraper and then everything just washes right out. A lot of people say never use soap in your cast iron because of the oil that's in it. And that's not really true. You're not going to destroy that baked on seasoned finish because it's literally baked on. You can't wash that off with soap. So I definitely use soap once in a while to, if I feel like it needs a little extra, just a little bit of soap, a little bit of scrubbing. They come out beautiful. One thing about washing them, you're not gonna set this and let it soak overnight like you might do with a stainless steel pan. In fact, you're also not gonna wash it and just hang it to dry. You definitely wanna make sure you dry it because it can rust. And that's the next thing I wanna talk about, rust. Pans do get rusty. We have this nice pan that we use for the campfire upstate and we left it out in the weather and you can see it's got quite a bit of rust in it. I will definitely be cleaning this because this is still good. This pan can definitely be restored. So that's the next thing. They literally last forever. This is something that can be left to your children and your grandchildren and your grandchildren's children and still be useful and look as beautiful as the day it was purchased. But the seasoning does not last forever. Cooking in it and doing all sorts of things with the pots and the pans as you use them, eventually the seasoning does need to be redone. Big deal, it's really easy. A little bit of oil, throw it in the oven, bake it for a while and it's good as new. So in summary, I highly recommend cooking with cast iron. Can't imagine myself cooking with anything else. I think it makes me a better cook. I think the food comes out better. I think it tastes better. And I feel like it's so much healthier than cooking in anything else. For the price, for a skillet that will cook amazing for the rest of your life, your children's lives and your grandchildren's lives, worth every penny. Pros far outweigh the cons. That's my truth about cooking with cast iron. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. See you on the next video.